Take a look at the block that was most affected by the explosion. At first glance, it may appear dark, dreary, and desolate. However, there's still quite a bit of hope left for the neighborhood, and a lot of color too. However, there's still quite a bit of hope left for the neighborhood, and a lot of color too. Tomorrow afternoon, starting at noon, New Yorkers and tourists alike will meet on the corner of St. Mark's Place and 2nd Avenue at Gem Spa and end at the New Yorkers Market for an afternoon of fun and fundraising. That's all thanks to Jeremiah Moss, creator of the hashtag SaveNYC campaign. The intention behind the movement? To quote, bring attention to the plight of mom and pop and to lobby state and city government to implement significant and powerful protections for small businesses and cultural institutions across the five boroughs of New York City. I'm here at Bar Barrage, located right across the street from where the explosion took place. Barrage is one of eight businesses planning to participate in tomorrow's small business fraud. Employees tell us that despite them having to close down for six days because of the explosion, they expect to fill all of these seats and be at full capacity tomorrow afternoon. There's a chance it's probably put some sort of tension and stress on the management. I know that I've been warned about how busy we're going to be. I think tomorrow's Second Avenue is going to be popping, definitely. George can certainly count on one man's business. Jordy's been living in the area for over 20 years, three buildings behind the explosion. He's eager for tomorrow's crawl. I think it's important to um, support your community and support your neighbors. Uh, these are places that I haunt every, every day, every week, um, and I would hate to see places dis disappear. You know, there's something beautiful about like old New York, and when you have something like you know, the East Village is a very tight community, and I'm proud to be a part of that community. So, yeah, I'm anxious to p participate tomorrow. And so, if you don't have any plans for tomorrow afternoon, consider taking a stroll down Second Avenue in St. Mark's. Word on the street is. Gem Spa makes a mean egg cream. Melissa Ferris, Columbia News Tonight.